Now we are going to copy and move cell entries inside of Excel. If you select cells B3 through E3 and you click the copy button here in the clipboard group on the home tab, it will copy this information to your clipboard. If you want to see it in the clipboard, you can expand the clipboard here and you'll notice that we now have what was copied pasted inside of the clipboard for future use. I can now click inside of cell B19 and click the Paste button. When I do this, it pastes the information that I copied to my clipboard to this location. If I decide I don't want it here, while it's still highlighted, I can hit the Delete key and it removes it. Now I'm going to select B20. I'm going to click the first item here in the Office Clipboard and it pastes that information there. If you had a number of options here in your clipboard, you could select the option that you want to paste, select it, and it will paste it in the area that you have highlighted. Now I'm going to click inside of cell A14. I'm going to hold down my control key and I'm going to point to the edge of the cell under the pointer till it changes. See how my cursor changed? Now I'm going to drag to cell A14 through A21. And it copied. This is another way that you can copy the information. Again, I'm going to click in A15, hold down my control key, move my mouse till it changes position, come down to A22, and let go. I can continue to do this until I get the information copied that I need to have copied. Now, inside of cell A21, I want to change that from a 20% to 30%. I have the cell highlighted. I'm going to come up now to the formula bar. I will click to the right of the 20, hit in the 2 and the 20, hit backspace, type a 3, and click outside of that cell reference. I now have 30% rise. Since I've changed this to be a 30% rise, I need to click inside of cell B21. Inside of B21, I'm going to change my formula so that it shows a 30% increase instead of a 20% increase. One of the ways I can do this is I'm going to hit Equals. I will select B12. Then I'm going to type an asterisk and do 1.3 and select my Enter. This will show a 30% increase. Then I can drag this formula across in order to show the increase all the way across.